Hey guys, so this game is Demetrio's The Big Cynical Adventure, and it is a point and click adventure game available for Mac OS X, Microsoft Wino Windows, PlayStation Vita, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. So yeah, being a point and click adventure game, I don't know how well I'm gonna like this on PS4, but uh, we're, we're definitely gonna try it. Um, one of the things that I actually really liked about this game, just through part of the trailer that I watched, is that it has hand-drawn artwork, which I think is absolutely amazing. So, um, I'm gonna try to get Garfield out of my lap so I can play this game for you guys. <laughs> He's so comfy, I don't want to move him. All right, guys, uh, let's see. Do you like toilet humor? Yes, give me all of it, just a little. No, I don't want any. Um. <laughs> well, I mean, it doesn't really bother me. I come from like a medical family, so I'm kind of used to like gross things and stuff like that. So I don't, I mean, but for, I don't know, what do you guys think? I guess we'll just go for a little because of YouTube. Don't want to get demonetized. <laughs> Paris, a hot July night. My name is Bjorn. Bjorn, I guess is how you would say that. Uh, sorry, I'm a bit drunk currently. Anyway, on that fateful night, I got a call. Uh-oh. Drunk and getting phone calls. That's not good. Uh, hello? Mr. Thorin? Yeah, that's me, but who... I need to warn you. You are in grave danger. What the... Oh, I get it. Good prank. Haha. -ha. Night. No, wait. Don't... If only I had known that this phone call would change my life forever. Man, if I got a phone call like that in the middle of the night, I'd be taking that stuff probably seriously. But I'm a little paranoid, so I don't know. If I was drunk, maybe I wouldn't take it so seriously. A noise? Is someone in my apartment? I did the first thing that came to mind. Took a flashlight and moved toward the living room. There seemed to be nothing. Mm. Behind you. I fell flat on the floor. Should have listened to that phone call, bro. A few hours later. I woke up suddenly. That sound. The phone. I ran to pick it up. Hello? Uh, Bjorn? Why the heck are you still home? Uh, Tom, I had some trouble. Don't tell me you forgot you were fishing today. Come here at once. Sorry, I don't think I'll come. I have some important matters to attend to. Yeah, like getting your head fixed, bro? Uh, knowing you, I guess it won't change your mind. Alright then, just come for dinner this evening. You can tell me more then. Alright, I'll do my best. See ya. Ouch, my head hurts. What happened already? I think someone was in my apartment. He must have knocked me out. Before reporting to the police, I'd better check and see if anything's missing. Alright. Parish Maris. <laughs> Ooh, alright. So, how will I conduct my search? First of all, can we talk about that? What is that? A cat on the armoire over there? Where can I get this armoire? I need it. Uh, do you need instructions? I'm good, thanks. I don't know. I should probably read the instructions. Uh, let's see. Slow movement, fast movement, L2, R2 to accelerate. Okay, well, that's easy enough, I guess. Uh, scroll inventory, view hotspots, validate, open bar menu, and open inventory bar. Okay. Let's start. Stone painting. That painting is really something. 
There are several interpretations for the pattern, though. According to ancient alien theorists, this represents a UFO destroying the Earth on Judgment Day, but some others say the truth is out there. That is what they say. I am not even going to try to butcher this. Puro della Francesa? It could mean Stone of France, or maybe French fries. Hmm, French fries, that does sound good. I like to read my comics here. That's why I needed a lamp. I couldn't put it anywhere else. It's a very strange place to put a lamp, like in the middle of the floor, but if you say so. Uh, that armchair looks nice, but actually it's awful. After sitting in it for an hour, I can't get out of it. Bag of chips. I lost that packet of crisps last month. Crunch, crunch. Still good. Ooh, a game console. The salesman told me it was the all new next gen must have console. Somehow I feel cheated. Oh, we can even look in the drawers. Okay. Let's see if I can. It's stuck. I can't open it. Weird, there's no lock. You probably got something stuffed in there, bro. Uh, there are only magazines in this drawer. More precisely, hundreds of TV channel listings. Oh, I borrowed this DVD from Tom. Snow White and the Little... And the Three Little Pigs. Uh, I love cartoon movies. Reminds me of my childhood. Oh my goodness, those pigs are a little... Uh... Interesting. Uh, what's that X rating on the back? Probably a mistake. Mm-hmm. Uh, using items. To combine an item, select it in the inventory and use it on the screen. Okay. I don't feel like I have anything that I can combine. If you say so. I lost the remote control, so it's stuck on the cooking fan channel. Only cooking programs. Okay, so I guess some of this is cut off because like I can't see what this is so I don't know. I don't know if it's going to be cut off in the video but it's cut off on my TV. Ugly piece of pottery. My aunt makes pottery. She gave me this. I couldn't bring myself to throw it out. Oh, aren't you nice. Oh. Um, wow, I should really stop touching it now. Yeah, it does kind of seem that way, doesn't it? Power outlet. Well, it's a power socket, although this makes me think. I've always wondered what it really does if you put your finger in there. Uh, we should probably not do that. Why? Right, why would I do that? It's childish. Actually, fun fact for you guys. Um, whenever I was a little kid, I don't know, I, have, I think it was like three or four, I stuck a penny into a socket and got pretty freaking electrocuted <laughs> um i don't know if you guys remember but like the little you know like a piggy bank like i thought you put the you could put the change like in that socket because like i had a little piggy bank so i would always drop the coins like in there so i guess that's where the idea came from but uh yeah i got electrocuted so there's uh trash on the floor uh it wasn't like that yesterday the burglar must have stepped on it seriously what kind of thief trips over trash bags well, I'm not sure. A cupboard door. It's filled to the broom with all the stuff I've picked up in the street. You never know. But now I can't open it without taking the risk to die a violent death. A vacuum iron. Cleaning products. Useless stuff. Ah, yes, I remember now. That's the only door with the lock, so I keep some cash in there. Now the question is, where's the key? Oh my gosh, you don't know where the key is? I've kept my favorite pink sheets from childhood in here. Um, did I say pink? I meant blue. What's this? Looks like a can of food. I should grab it. It's high, so high. Not high enough though. Twice more sausages. This can contains two sausages. Best before October 1998. Well, they say it's best to eat before that date. Not required, good enough for me. Oh boy. My clock works like clockwork. <laughs> so funny, bro. Alright, so I have a left shoe. One of my boots. My favorites for winter. They keep your feet warm. I wonder where the other one is. Not sure. The radiator works like an old frying pan. I swear I cooked eggs on it once. Well, that's not weird at all. Mirror, looking good. 
Whoa, what is that? I should get a haircut. It looks like an alien back there. Okay, so let's check this closet out. Books, some great books I got for super cheap, only one euro each. That does sound cheap. I love these things. They remind me of Christmas. Even if I don't like Christmas that much, my parents never gave me any present. Well, that's sad. Uh, they said it was too commercial and that Santa doesn't exist. Whoops, spoilers. Uh, how could they lie to me like that? Urgent box. Oh, yes. I put some urgent things to do inside a few years ago. Totally forgot about that. Well, I guess the urgent box isn't very urgent. now, is it? Uh, my cousins are very religious. They offered me this angel. They said it's the angel of beauty and purity. I use it to scare away insects. Huh? I can't stand ties. That awful feeling of having your throat squeezed and suffocating. This guy is... Certainly opinionated. I can't pull the curtain back any further. There's nothing interesting behind it anyways. Uh, her, uh, weird. I heard these things grow in closets, but mine doesn't. Maybe I should have watered it. Okay, that's strange. I'm absolutely certain there's something useful here, like a key or something, but I can't see a thing. Ah, uh, I don't know if I got everything. Uh, umbrellas? I don't need an umbrella for now. The sun is shining. Uh, must not be in England, right? Uh, that bag is really mysterious. Let's have a look-see. Hmm, well, after looking inside, I think it's better to leave that mystery alone. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's totally empty. I've never put anything inside. Maybe that's why. I guess that would be why. Tissues. A mint condition tissue box. Wow. I know this would be better next to my printer, but I don't have one. Handcuffs? I don't need them for now. Uh, a mask? A carnival mask. So cool. Wearing that, no one can see who you are. Now that's the belt. Now what's that belt doing here? Oh yeah, I remember now. Silly me. Eiffel Tower. Oh, I forgot I had this. A mini vibrating Eiffel Tower. Say it. It still has batteries. These could come in handy. I'll just put that aside. All right, time to get out of here, guys. This man's closet is a little sketchy. So, let's go to the bathroom. Let's check out this medicine cabinet. Uh, here's a bag. That looked interesting, but it ended there. Nothing in it and don't need a purse. Scissors, you never know you'll need some good scissors. I hope they don't cut a hole in my pants. I think you'll be fine. Toiletries. Clippers? Who needs their... Who goes to the hairdresser nowadays? With this wonderful technology, anyone can save the 20 years for a haircut. Mm. My favorite. It smells like water and it has the same color too. Hmm. Yeah, okay. The name is cool. Med 500. If I only knew what that was for. Uh, this is my deodorant. Coconut deodorant, huh? Uh, freshen up with this coconut flavored deodorant. The tropics will come destroy your filth. My blush. Oops, no. Slip of the tongue. You need blush, huh? Oops. I'm not a woman, even if I do have hormone fluctuations sometimes. Okay, so... Just some wash gloves and disposable razors. Oh, and a bag of cat food. Ooh, cat food. Does that mean you have a cat? Oh, I totally forgot I had this can of white paint. This dates back from when I repainted the room two years ago. Funny how things become invisible when you see them every day. Slippers. I recommend these. Very helpful for cleaning the room without leaving a trace on the floor. Actually, I have seen these slippers. So that's pretty funny. Uh, my toothbrush, toothpaste, and some peanut butter. Why do you have peanut butter next to your toothbrush? Every bathroom needs a hairbrush. I mean, who doesn't have one? Men with messy hair, of course. Oh, so funny. A little tiny, whiny, cutesy house. Okay. I almost washed my hands with that. Hey, we got a cookie. I wonder what I could do with that. Cookies are special items scattered everywhere. There are three cookies on each screen. Pick them up to use in-game help icon in the top bar when you're stuck. 
I've heard the bathroom power sockets have extra protection. I wonder what would happen if I stuck my finger in there. Why do we still want to stick our finger in sockets? We are too old for this. I'm lucky the sink never gets clogged. Doing my laundry in it probably helps. You do your laundry in the sink. Okay. Just a regular mirror. What did I expect? A ghostly face coming out of it? It's cleaner, clearer with that there, isn't it? Oh boy. A man's bathroom. This bin is dedicated to storing every useless paper I read here. Thank goodness for whomever invented toilet paper. Uh, the toilet paper is the main thing that distinguishes us from animals. Uh, let's not use the toilet. I hope. Okay, fine. Do you want to use the toilet? All right, but I'd like some privacy. Okay, use the toilet. I guess this is where the, uh, the toilet sense of humor comes in. That shouldn't be over. There you go. Ah, such a relief. Oh, it's so cute. It always smells good even when I don't clean it. Must be some black magic involved. Hmm. I just have a feeling that, uh... That toilet is nasty. Even for, like, hand-drawn artwork, that toilet is nasty. Supposedly, they're bleach tablets. I've never been able to open it, though. Blasted child protection. How old are you? Don't usually carry toilet paper with me. I love nature. Cleaning products. That's what you need. You need to clean your toilet. Uh, you think this carton hides a lot of interesting duhas. Actually, it's an empty as my bank account. I love to read magazines when I'm doing my thing. <laughs> okay. There are all these cards I managed to save from my childhood. If only I could drive these. I'm sick of walking. Gosh, this guy is such a baby. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh... Oops. Um... Let's go to the living room. And... Let me see. Can I click on... No. Okay. Let's go to the bedroom. There I... Teddy bear! I don't travel without my favorite teddy bear anymore. I won't take the risk of damaging it. Oops. Um... Don't worry, Daddy's here. Hmm. It's not that comfortable or pretty, but I don't care. When you sleep, you don't notice details like that. Well, that's fair. Phone. I rarely use my landline phone. My cell phone has much better sound, and it's so practical. Where is it anyways? Oh my gosh, now we gotta search for that. Socks, socks everywhere. Um... A halberd and a stick. Some kind of weapon, I believe. They came from my antique store. I can't even remember why I bought them here. A mouse hole? Anybody home, mousey? Oh no, no answer. Maybe it died of hunger or something. Well, that's nice. I can't see an interesting article in this old newspaper. I used to store some money and important papers in there, but it was too obvious a hiding spot, so I moved from somewhere else. Seems like a book for learning how to cook. Who needs that? Not me, anyways. Uh, only some clothes and underpants in there. I like the music. Comics are fun. I mostly love European comics such as Tanton, Anthrax, or Lucky Lake. The story of a little boy expelled from his home. Plates. Really nice plates. I got them for 50, quote, magical points at my supermarket. The Mano Lisa. Yep, this is a man's reconstruction of Mona. It was made by an artist named Leonardo da Vinci. Of course it was. Rather handy if I have a heart attack, they can just put me inside directly. Or someone knocks you over the head like they did last night. Recently, I made an advertisement to promote my store. I bought all the stuff here to take pictures so I'd look more authentic. I'd gather all kinds of doohaws in these bags. I don't want to get rid of them, but at the same time, I have no intention of ever touching them again. Hey, a flashlight. I had it in my hand when I was knocked out last night. There's only one problem. The batteries are dead. I need replacements. Lucky for you, I have those. Hi, that's me. Bjorn the pirate. Arr. I got this statue a few months ago. Don't know what exactly that bird is supposed to represent, but it looks cool. Hey, wait a minute. There was a tablet on it earlier. I remember it clearly because it er, fell 
when I moved the statue last week, but I know I put it back. It was a tablet sh shaped like a lightning bolt. It's gone and I don't see it anywhere else in here. So the thief must have taken it, but why? I'd better tell the police about this. Literally, I went into every room and the whole mission was to figure out if the, if, you know, the police, if something got stolen and literally it was the last thing I clicked on. That's insane. Okay, so... They're the same size, good. Okay, so w let's put some, uh, we put some batteries into the flashlight. And I wonder, do I have, whoa, that was weird. Um, where is my, there it is. My thing kind of went off the, um, screen there. So what is this? Oh, it's a cookie. Um, so I feel like there should have been another cookie somewhere. Let me check. Okay, so I think, um, go back up here and check. Oh, so is there three cookies in a room? Wait. Hey, this pocket. Uh, there's something wrong. It's empty. I've been robbed. Cash, credit card, all gone. Well, that shouldn't be a surprise. The thief must have taken it. At least he left my ID card. What a gentleman. Okay, so I missed that last time. Uh, goodbye shopping plans. Fortunately, I sorted some spare money in that cupboard, but where's the key to open it? That is the question. So, about box, living room. It doesn't look like I can get anything out of there. Let's go back to the bathroom. There's a towel. Um, I don't know where the. I hope there's not a cookie in here because ew. Um. So. I don't know where this key is. No idea. Let's see if we can... I tried calling my cell phone, but it didn't hear anything. It's probably not in the apartment. Where did I leave it? Well, that's not very helpful. Okay, guys. So, I was, like, running around because I was kind of lost as to what to do. Um, you have to equip the flashlight and then go back to the closet and look in that box that he mentioned earlier so um now that you have the flashlight on you can see into the box so he says uh much better now i can rummage through this mess here's my broken computer my sewing supplies and a pet petter awesome there's a fl here's a flashlight i needed let's go put that back aha i found something interesting uh by the way what does this key open okay so yeah that actually that actually took took me a minute. I, I had to look that up because I did not understand why. I, I, didn't, I didn't know where to go next. And I didn't want to use a hint, so I looked it up. Holly is going to be honest. Okay, so let's take this key over here. Finally, some money. Wait, that's all? 575 euros i thought i had more left had me without my credit card great 
doesn't sound good. Okay, so I don't know. I think I got everything. Um, oops. <laughs> there goes the beautiful pottery Annie gave me. What a shame. Oh. Broken vase. Uh, what's that? A few fun fair coins from last year. Cool. Uh, what a coincidence. The fun fair starts tomorrow. I'll put these coins aside for now. Uh, <laughs> the, it's not broken. How is that even possible? It fell from six feet high. I don't know. All right, guys. So, ooh, um, I'm going to stop right here. I think this will be a good stopping point. Uh, we found a few things in our apartment that will hopefully help us on this adventure. And then we will uh, talk to little Sandra over here and see what she's got to say for herself. So if you guys enjoyed this video, let me know down in the comments below. Uh, this is a point and click adventure game. So it's something a little different than uh, some of the games that I do play on my channel, but I really like the music and the art style is really neat. I like that everything's like hand drawn, like that's super cool. So uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video and thanks again for watching.